Well, hello there, fellow elite level gamer. Uh, my name is El Maxo, but you may notice this isn't the normal El Maxo channel. This is actually El Maxo Second, which has been very creatively named. Um, this is something different. This is this is a different channel for a different type of content. Sometimes I just don't feel like making these massive, grandiose projects, and sometimes I just want to sit down and talk to my mic about some of the stuff going on in my life, and hey, maybe you can relate to it, and some of the stuff I've been thinking, I, I don't know, I think I think it could be helpful to have this type of talk. It's just something I want to do. Uh, last eight weeks for me personally have been pretty challenging, I've been thinking about it a lot, I've had a lot of stuff going on, and I just thought, why not, vo not vocalize, I don't want to get too personal, but why not have like a, a, a place uh, I can... I can expel this off my chest too. I, I can talk to my, my microphone, send this off to the internet and have it publicly documented. So, you know, maybe in two years I can look back and be like, wow, what a fucking idiot. Or I don't know. I think it'd just be interesting to have this to log my process of thoughts through time. Um, nothing too serious. Probably quite lighthearted most of the time, I imagine. But yeah, I just wanted to kick it off here and start things with a welcome video. Uh, and there is a topic I want to talk about. And the topic, it's kind of about burnout, it's kind of about creating videos and the process behind it. Because it's something that I don't, I don't know what, what the average L Max of viewers insight into this is. But making videos can be pretty hard sometimes. It might not look like it, it might, not, it might look like I'm a, a goofy gamer who collects some clips and thinks up a stupid script in like two minutes and voila, we've got a, we've got a certified L Max of video. But sometimes it's, it's quite hard actually. And that's something I've had uh, the last two weeks especially. Ever since I released that Gun Spy Unleashed video, I finished it a few days before I released it. And ever since then, I've just been really struggling to get a good idea of what to make a video on. I've had like three different scripts I've worked, I've probably written 10,000 words collect, actually even more, I think maybe like 15,000, I had a really long one at one point. And one's kind of forming up now, which I think will be the next video, but it's gonna be a pretty big project. But it's just, it's just hard sometimes, you know, because I think, to me, YouTube is this, this outlet of creativity. It's something I can go and I can I can make some silly jokes, I can do some writing, um, and, and treat it like a, like a, a piece of art, somewhat. I'm not claiming, I'm, not claiming I'm, I'm Radiohead producing OK Computer, but, but to me, it's, there's some creative expression in it, right? So it's, it's not like I can be this monotonous, uh, repetitive robot who just shits out videos, unless I did maybe weapon reviews every day, but that, that's, I don't really want to do that anymore. Um, but no, I, I'm a human being, and sometimes ideas are hard, sometimes good ideas are hard, and, you know, since I've, I've announced I'm trying to take this a bit more seriously, I've, I've deferred university again, um, it can be kind of stressful, because I'm, I'm dependent on a video doing well f for me to get income. I, I have a very fortunate family situation, so it's not like I, I have to pay utilities or anything like that, but if I want to have money to save and do whatever with, I have to have videos perform well right now, it's, that's what I'm relying on. Um, so I've been in this a bit of a stressful loop lately um, about making videos uh, and just getting a, like a good idea. I just want a good original idea to, to, to just hammer in on because once I've, I've gotten an idea out, I've written it and I've recorded it, once I get to that editing stage I, for like seven days straight, you'll probably see me on Discord in Premiere Pro for like 12 hours a day because I, I fucking I love editing. But, but getting to the stage of editing is like the hardest thing to do sometimes, especially right now. I, I'm really really struggling. I, I had this script. I won't, I won't talk about what it is, but I've read about 4,000 words and I think it will be my next video. I, I, I read it through, I recorded it, just a rough draft. And I was like, yeah, this is, this is pretty good. And then I went out, uh, I went and watched some Funk. Uh, Funk's, I, I, I binged his latest three videos and I was like, oh, he writes so well. It's like actually impeccable. And then I look at what I've written. I'm like, I, I am a failure. I'm a, a horrible online content creator. Um, and I just, I just want to improve it more. And it can be a bit of a vicious cycle when you, you look up to so many creators and you're like, I wish I could be as good as them. But, you know, I kind of got to remind myself, Funk's what, I think five years older than me. He's been making videos for way longer. He's got a lot more experience. He's been through a lot more. So it only makes sense. But it's just, it's just tough. I, I, I you know, I've written this full script and I sit down, I'm like, damn it, it could be better, but I don't think I'm capable of making it to like this golden standard I want yet. And it can be a little stressful because I've got to factor in money and the stuff I was talking about before. So I don't know. It's not all easy sailings making videos, surprisingly. Um, I feel like sometimes if you look at the, the end product, you might be able to say, oh, you could hammer that out. But just like idea generation and writing scripts that aren't shit, it can be quite hard. There's, there's a lot of things that go into making a video and I'm, I'm here ranting that sometimes it can be hard. So you, you can't expect uh, weekly high quality shit because I just, I'm not capable of that. 
And that's the main thing I want to talk about tomorrow. So I wasn't super in depth. Um, this sort of idea of content's been inspired by people like Funk on his second channel. He had he did two videos that I actually really enjoyed listening to, hearing his perspective on. Uh, I think it was like feeling stuck in your twenties. And this has also, of course, been influenced by Jay Schlatt's The Weekly Slap, which I think two years ago I was actually watching like semi religiously. I really like hearing someone in a position online who had like a lot uh, claimed a lot of views and subs. And hearing they're just answering the, the questions of fans and stuff like that, that's always like a really nice personable thing because sometimes I want you guys to know that I, I am also a person. I am, I am El Max, so I am, I am Max. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I think this could be a good thing to have out there, um, these videos if you care. Um, and you can just watch them to see where I'm at and where maybe you're at. Maybe, maybe some of the future videos could provide a lot more help. This is mainly just the first thing to kick things off. But um, yeah, I, I, have a, I had a new computer arrive today. 3070 Ti. I'm gonna to look to start streaming more. I wanna I wanna make a stronger community on Discord. I've got a Minecraft server I've just bought for us boys. Let's fucking go. And yeah, I think I really wanna take this seriously because making videos is something I really enjoy and I really wanna see how far I can take it in being a an online personality somewhat, because I think it could be kind of funny, <laughs> to be honest. And it's saying I look forward to a lot, but yeah, I won't, I won't actually, I'll, I'll keep it there for now. Uh, I'll, I don't know how often I'm going to post it, maybe weekly, maybe twice a week. If I've just got something on my mind I want to talk about, but yeah, that's all for now. I hope you're doing well and yeah, uh, that's all. Farewell, Elite Level Gamer.